Granny's Flat Reserve. Jamison State Forest. Camping, toilets, fires, tables, no motorbikes, no guns. rugged north, to the beautiful south, to the centre, east, west, doesn't matter where, the four wheel drive tips and tricks and travel and information, you have come to the right place. Come for a ride with us, Mud Ducks four wheel drive tour. Well, g'day everybody, Steve from Mud Ducks 4 Wheel Drive Touring with another spotlight on campgrounds. As you can see today, we are at Granny's Flat Reserve Campground, about 20 odd kilometres, I think, from the small town of Jamison in the Victorian high country. So, uh, looks like a nice little spot. Let's have a look at it, guys. So, from the sign that you just saw, there is your entry road. We come down the hill and that brings you to the sign. Now off to the right immediately is a little semi-secluded campground which would be good for pretty well one vehicle camping. But there is a little bit more grass just there that you could set up on. If you're a tent camper or well, swag camper without much else you could set up there behind the sign just near this river crossing so we'll go down this way on the left hand side of a track here's some more fire places that you can see and it's relatively flat and grassy so you could camp there you'd be looking at one behind the other camping here on this side and realistically the same on that side so you've got that but you are on this beautiful river here and like all rivers in the Vic High Country what do you reckon you could give trout fishing a go in this so uh, that'd be nice otherwise you can just go for a general hike I think now it has got facilities there's some drop toilets just here so that will make one's life much easier and i'd imagine there's times where this place is busy as you can camp just here it's the same deal it'll be all one behind the other style camping now the road from jamison to get here suggests that you don't bring caravans, buses or semi-trailers on these roads. So I haven't tried it the other way to see what it's like further up, but that's what it says from the Jamison end. 
So bear that in mind now. On the right is your main campground. And as you can see, there's a few people in there, so I won't go in there and disturb them. There's another set of toilets, amenities in there. So that's comfortable and nice. It's all nice and grassy. It's very pretty. And as you can see, there's a fair bit of room. At least half a dozen camps in there, picnic tables, and so on. Now over in this bit, close to the river, which is beautiful, we've got some bollards to keep everybody out of there, and that's fair enough. This occasion, it's fair enough. Oh, by the way, this campground, like every campground so far I've reviewed in Victoria, there is no fees. It is free. So... New South Wales, you could take a leaf out of Victoria's book, I can tell you. As you can see, there's been lots of fire pits set up in different places. But uh, it's all pretty good. If you know what you're doing, it's fine. It's a little caravan in there, but it's about camper trailer size, so I figure it's probably okay to do that. Yeah, I'm still walking the same bloody distance, or well, same direction, away from that sign. And we get straight into a track here called Gallows Track. And it leads you to Mitchell's Bridal Trail, which is a hike. So there is hiking around here. So bear that in mind. Seasonal road closures on that, as you'd expect. More nice camps down here alongside the river. And as I said before, I don't, won't go too close and bother the people who are camping here already. As you can see, there's room for those people there. It's a pretty big campground, this really. And it's very pretty, it's alongside the water. And like I said earlier, best of all, it's free. So you gotta like that. Getting towards the end of it, still got access to the water here. And then there's just a turning circle road. Then back the other way. So, that's all very nice, isn't it? Very pretty river, this. Now, right on the end of the turning circle is another single camp where somebody's just setting up. So, I won't go in there. So, you've got room for uh, quite a few in here. I'll flick you back to me. So, it's a fairly spacious campground. It's mostly grassy. It's mostly flat. So, you can put pretty well everything in here. So that's got to be a good thing. Because that's the beauty and the reason we come out to these places. But realistically, if you're wandering around in the Vic High Country, and you plan to do some tracks, then I reckon you'd want to do it in a four-wheel drive, wouldn't you? I mean, I'm doing Mud Ducks four-wheel drive touring, so if you're watching me, you're possibly interested in going camping with a four-wheel drive. I'd suggest you are. Now, what I'll do is, as I've walked you this far, I'll just cut you off here, when I get back to the sign, I'll take you the other way from the turn off, which is much smaller. Pretty well nearly at the end of it then. But I'll show you that when I get there, rather than you have to stare at my ugly mug walking back there. So I'll see you soon.
Welcome back. I'm back at the river crossing, give you another look at that. And at the back of the sign. So, at this point, if you came down the hill and you turn left, you'll be camped where we are. There's enough room here for probably half a dozen. It'd be good if you're friendly. So a group of half a dozen together would be great in here. I reckon you could get a little camp just there, to that side of the bollards. And then there's another room, room for another camp just here, to the left of where the land cruiser is. We've got that spot there. There's room behind us. You could squeeze in there easily enough. Tony and Janice are camped in there. And like I said, if you've got some friends and they're all camping as well, we can get them in here. So half a dozen cars would pretty well get this one done on the end of all the other stuff I showed you previously. And there's access to the river. There's access to the river everywhere here. Little walking tracks. I'll give you a look at this water here because we all do like to have a look at rivers don't we isn't that pretty in fact if you camped here on the end you'd have that as a view should have had a better look could have had the truck closer down anyway <laughs> that's how it is so there's where we've been swimming earlier in the day isn't it nice? All right, well, that's probably bringing you pretty well to the end of this. Sorry about looking at the sky for a second. Anyway, hope you enjoyed this. This is Granny's Flat Campground in the Victorian High Country, 20 odd Ks from Jamison. Uh, if you did like it, put a like on it, it really helps the channel. If you're new here, consider subscribing. And if you do subscribe, uh, think about clicking the bell and get the notifications and then you'll know when I put up a new clip. And to be old hands, thanks again, as always, for taking the time out of your day to watch one of my clips. And just remember, guys, just get out there, enjoy the bush, and we will see you on the next one. Cheers from Steve and Kaz at Mud Ducks 4 Drive Touring. Have a great one, guys.